Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Token Moments. My name is Token Makiwa. Oh my gosh. Oh, I could pass for, uh, I don't even know. Oh my God, I love this hair. I was so scared before I did my hair because um, I've never really done this sort of curly hair. And I kept thinking, oh my God, what if it doesn't fit me? You know, what if I don't like it? What if I look funny? Hey, this is summertime, ladies and gentlemen. This is the hair to carry into town. Woo! I love this. There's nothing like self-love. Yeah, I've got loads of that. There's nothing like self-appreciation. I have no problems appreciating myself. And uh, yeah, I'm just going to stop being all about me. Okay, so welcome to another episode of Token Moments. My name is Token Makinwa. If this is your very first time of watching any one of our videos, do not be worried. Anything can happen. Sometimes I go off and sometimes I'm very calm and sometimes, you know, I don't even know what I am. But I get really excited every time I get the opportunity to shoot a video. Something really exciting happened to me today. I bought myself a camera. Well, it's not one of those high-end cameras because I'm... Literally just learning. Uh, for a while now, I've been shooting my vlog on my laptop. Yes, I do. And I edit it myself. And uh, you know what? I just decided to invest in this vlog. I want to have like a sharp quality video. You know, all those sharp ones. You know, I want those, you know, really, really nice quality videos. So I thought to myself, why don't you just buy yourself a camera? And so I bought the GoPro camera and I bought like a tripod stand. And I can't wait to read the manual. And I can't wait to get right into it. I basically start to shoot high def videos. Yay! The very first video we'll shoot, just know that it's not a cameraman or this is not like a, a film person. This is just me, you know, getting a hang of this. Like when I started this, I just started shooting on my on my laptop. And then I started editing. I knew nothing about editing. And sometimes I still make mistakes. But it's all about just practicing and learning, which is basically what I want to talk to you guys about. Uh, today but I really just wanted to connect with you guys and just to sort of just you know just let you guys know that there's nothing that you want to do that you cannot achieve if you put your mind to it I mean when I started my vlog it was one of the dumbest things I thought I was doing but look at it today it's connected me with millions of people I am so blessed I mean every time I open my email the vlog needs its own email because you guys are just crashing on my own email, you know. Uh, I can't even begin to tell you guys how, you know, from little beginnings, doors have opened and, you know, it's basically become what it has now. It can do more, which is why I'm investing in it. So it's all about believing in yourself and investing in yourself. That's what we're talking about today. No one can invest in you as much as you would invest in yourself. You need to begin to start to believe in yourself. You need to begin to start to invest in yourself. Invest in making yourself smile. Even if you earn 20,000 naira, trust me, you can invest in yourself. Some people might think, oh my God, must it be material stuff? It doesn't really have to be, okay? You can invest in books you read, invest in, in developing yourself finding what makes you happy. Nobody can truly make you happy. Your happiness is in the hands of God. I'm just telling you right now. If you are one of those people that puts your happiness in the hands of a man or a woman, you just might be in for a very rude shock. You have to basically just love yourself. No one ever cares about anyone who doesn't care about themselves, to be honest, okay? And, you know, you can go through life being a victim or being pitiful or wanting to roll over and die. Get up! What is wrong with you? What is strong with you? Are you the first? Are you going to be the last? No. You think you have it worse. When you sit with someone else and they tell you quarter of what they're having to deal with, then you realize that your life is not that bad after all. Life is not that hard. We human beings, we make it harder than it usually is. Sometimes life is as easy as just getting up in the morning and wearing your makeup and doing your mascara and just going. Life is as easy as you staring that problem down and saying, you know what, I can't die. I can't kill myself. I can't roll over and die. So you know what, I'm going to leave. I'm going to take each day as it comes. I owe it to myself to do one happy thing for me. You know, it doesn't matter how bad life has been. It doesn't matter where you're coming from. It doesn't matter what happens. Yes, you lost that job. Yes, that relationship didn't work out. Yes, you feel like nobody likes you. Truth of the matter is, nobody will like you if you don't like yourself. You need to begin to just say to yourself, okay, so what? What's the worst thing that could happen? Have you, have you ever asked yourself that question? What is the worst thing that could happen? Okay, you want to marry. Guy is not coming. Will you marry yourself? Okay, 
Will you kill yourself? Okay, what's the worst thing that can happen? You'll be single. Okay. Is single so bad? Maybe if you begin to appreciate yourself and you begin to do those little things for yourself, invest in doing your hair, invest in wearing your nails. Do not put what makes you happy in the hands of anybody because you know what? <laughs> As someone said to me this week, I'm going to say it in Yoruba. So if you don't understand Yoruba, then you might need someone to translate to you. Ikule de any fucking time. Sure, yeah. So if you like, be there putting all your happiness, all your joy into something that it's not basically yielding anything or giving you anything in return the truth is you spend so much time trying to do something that is not going to work life is not that bad and you can open the door for happiness to find you and open the door for you know the right man to locate you who knows that person might be someone that you've known all your life but because you're so caught up in your head you cannot give yourself the room to breathe you know stop waiting for a superman stop waiting for a superwoman you are all you need to make a difference i'm no preacher yeah but you know when i bought the camera today i thought to myself wow we've come a long way if you're not happy on your job and the job is really weighing you down and you feel like, oh my God, I'm just working to earn a living and I'm just counting down to payday. I know that the state of things are hard, and, but the truth of the matter is you would never, ever find fulfillment just working that nine to five. You would never, ever find joy and you begin to affect every other area of your life. And then you begin to be unhappy about other things. I'm unhappy about my weight. I'm unhappy about my height. I'm unhappy about just the fact that nobody likes me. I'm unhappy about my hair. I'm unhappy about the way I look. The truth is it might just be the job you need to change. Give yourself a break. We don't also give ourselves enough credits. And it's bad. I do it. I'm, trust me, I'm guilty of doing this. Where you just go through life and when things happen, even things you're supposed to celebrate, milestones you're supposed to celebrate, you don't really do that because you feel to yourself, oh, I'm bothered by this or this hasn't sorted itself out yet or that. Enjoy the moment, okay? Take some time out and appreciate your journey. Appreciate how far you've come. Appreciate the fact that, you know what? I'm not doing badly. I started from here and I'm here. It might not be where I want to be, but it's progress, and if I keep at it, I will get there. You know, if not, the goalposts will keep shifting. You get there, and if you're not happy, then you start to run around looking for something else to make you happy. If you cannot be completely happy with yourself, you cannot be happy with the world. You would always be that frustrated person. I'm not saying problems don't come. Heck, are you kidding? I'm not saying that life doesn't throw things at us. Come on. But I need you to begin to invest in yourself. Invest in your happiness. Invest in your peace of mind. Invest in your job. No one can do it for you. Ladies, begin to take better care of yourselves. Don't sit there and think, oh, I've had a baby. The weight is so hard to lose. I'm just, I'm just going to just remain like this. After all, ugh, if you cannot accept me this way, maybe you should go. No, that's not who you were. That's not the person you married. What about you picking up yourself and doing a bit? Run today. You don't try to rush everything. Just do it in bits and you'd find yourself doing even more than you thought you could do. It's better for you to try, even if it doesn't work, than for you to sit there and keep wondering what life would be like if you had, you know, taken a, a chance. I'm not a preacher, okay? This is just to let you guys see my fine face. And of course, to let you guys know that coming soon would have like high depth videos. <laughs> I'm so excited. And um, yeah, basically just to appreciate you guys. Thank you to everyone who has shared a word of kindness with me you guys you guys just do the most man like i can't begin to cry right now no i'm not <laughs> i'm not mad i promise you i'm not but i really 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 appreciate you all and i want to see a lot of people win you know life is hard things happen people are sad but you don't have to stay sad. It's a choice and it's a constant choice. It is a battle. But you have to keep telling yourself each day that, you know what, I'm going to win. I'm going to go through today. I'm going to do something nice for myself. Buy yourself ice cream. You know, take yourself to the spa. You know, get a massage. Do things that you wouldn't normally do. You know, go on holiday. Yes, it might be expensive, but there's so many places that you can go to that you don't have to break the bank. You know, spend some quality time with yourself. Try. Invest in you. No one else will do that. And people will keep taking and taking and taking and taking and taking from you. And one day you wake up and there's nothing. Whenever you feel down, remember, equally day any fucking time. Meaning, 
death can come anytime. Perhaps you will wake up or you make up, bounce out, and have a good time. And if life refuses to give you a good time, you tell life you're a bitch. I am going to have a good time. I'm not running mad, I promise. I'm so excited today, guys. I'm just really happy that I just wanted to share some positive energy with you all. It's gonna be a lovely day every day. Oh, look at my Brazilian hair. I look Brazilian, don't I? Oh, maybe South American. Hmm. I should go on holiday with this hair. Who oh, knows? Huh. Make all the boys go crazy. Hmm. Talk that you are gorgeous. Yes, I talk to myself like this. Sometimes that's all you need. You need to pick yourself up. Wear makeup some days. Just because you want to feel pretty. There's nothing wrong with that. Okay? Alright. Thank you guys for watching. I'll chat with you guys on the next episode of Talking Moments. Keep your head up. Anybody that wants to use their reggae to spoil your blues, tell them get off my dance floor. Get out of here, man. Shit. Life is short. If a boyfriend says it's not doing anymore, will you kill yourself? No. If a girl chop all your money and says she's not doing anymore, will you kill yourself? No. You gotta keep moving. You gotta not stop. You just gotta tell them, ha. Huh. You know what? I am the best thing since sliced bread. And if you don't see it, then you don't deserve to have me. So, bye bye. Talk with you guys later. I can't wait. I can't wait. Chat with you guys next week. Maybe I can even go into rapping. Hmm. Do you guys think I will sell? We can do some singing and then rapping, and then we can see how it goes. Ha! My single. Coming to a city near you very soon. I'm gonna rap. I'm gonna tell you life is short. Make sure you're happy. Nah, I've just made a complete fool of myself. I know. I'll chat with you guys next week. Goodbye.